some more people it's your girl wanja and you definitely on hang out and vibe with your girl wanja so today i'm super excited because it's about big calves and big boys we are at where are we at <laughs> kenya racing team next to nazarene university today is just the training day and tomorrow is going to be the big day tomorrow is the d day so you better be ready Again, we are back with Mr. George here at KRT, and we know we want to know a lot more about everything that is going down over here. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm very fine. Good. Uh, my name is George. Mm -hmm. I'm the chairman of Kenya Racing Team, and uh, I'm also one of the directors of Kenya Motorsports Federation. Yes. Well, uh, to start with the uh, short um the 4x4 challenge, mm -hmm. uh, we started it uh, way back uh, four years ago four when years ago. we were not affiliated first with the Kenya Motorsport Federation. Mm -hmm. And uh, I would like to thank our chairman, uh, Mr. Phineas Kimathi, also the CEO of uh, WRC, yes. for letting us uh, be affiliated to Kenya Motorsports Federation mm -hmm. and taking way ahead the 4x4 challenges into a national championship. Okay. For this event, this will be the first round mm -hmm. of the Kenya National 4x4 Challenge Championship. Yes. Of where uh, in this calendar, there are eight events which are going to count towards the championship. Eight. Eight events which are going to count to the national championship. In how long? Uh, in the calendar. Okay. Yeah, in the 2022 calendar. Okay. Basically, uh, there are some also at some other clubs who are seeing the same. This is a uh, sports club. Yes. Is a Meru Motorsports Club and there is a Meru Club and also the MC the 4x4s. Okay. So it's not only Kenya Racing Team alone, it's going to be holding this. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, I would like to know what, like, what made you want to be part of this, even before starting and everything? Well, I've been a car enthusiast and it's my hobby. Racing is my hobby and I started uh, with uh, being a service crew yes. during the days of safari uh -huh. I've uh, come all the way up, yes. um, started navigating, mm -hmm. navigated uh, the late Ben Mushemi, and navigated uh, Jasmine Chana. Mm -hmm. We won the championship mm -hmm. um, way back in 2005, I think. Yeah. And then uh, from navigation, I jumped into the driver's seat. You started with 4x4? No, 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 no. I started okay. with the motor racing. Yes, but also during the when I was still racing, mm -hmm. I was still uh, like saying one day I'll, I'll start a club and do four by four events. Okay. Since it's becoming so popular, that's yeah. why I said, okay, let me push for this uh -huh. and we see where I can take it to. Mm -hmm. And I've taken it that far and so happy for the people who have uh, come in to support me as a club Kenya Racing Team. Yes. And also, Kenya Motorsports Federation. Mm -hmm. um, I'm happy working with them. And uh, basically, most of all, is the, the competitors. Before they couldn't understand what was the meaning of a championship. Mm -hmm. Last year, we did the championship mm -hmm. where um, I had uh, two, three classes, yeah? yes. categories as a beginner, intermediate, and the expert. Mm -hmm. The winners being recognized at the annual award ceremony. The time now they start realizing okay, we've, uh, we've understood now what's what a championship means. So, basically, you also offer like classes before they become part of the championship. <coughs> um, basically, uh, how they are divided is in groups. Yes, um, there is a beginner, mm -hmm. then we have the intermediate, mm -hmm. then we have the expert, mm -hmm. and then we have the class, the super experts. Yes, different categories as depends on which car you are. 
you, you are entering. It depends on the axles you are driving in, it depends on whether you have the lockers or that's how they will be graded. Oh, the technical bit of your car? The technical bit of the car, we have the technical team, yes. we will do the split yearly and after that they will know which cars will be the expert, which one. Because you can't have a car which have lockers and then you say you are putting it into mm -hmm. the beginner. Yes. And th then also the age group. Mm -hmm. uh, we are splitting the age group from uh, 8 to 12 for yes. the beginners. Okay. Yeah. Now you can't have somebody who is 24 years uh -huh. and in is coming beginning. to do the beginner. <laughs> definitely that one. <laughs> what if their car fits in the beginner? Uh, no, definitely have to push them to intermediate. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. So uh, maybe you can tell us the technical bit, Kidogo, about the beginner and the others. Well, um, basically is the way uh, a beginner, mm -hmm. even you can do with your just standard car, mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. if it's a four wheel, uh, like proper seat belts. Mm -hmm. yeah. Definitely a helmet is compulsory. Mm -hmm. Then uh, when we come to the intermediate, mm -hmm. the car, we have what we call the roll cage. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. And also maybe you can, the height of the vehicle, the axles, yeah, the tires. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Then when we come to super experts, mm -hmm. those are the, now the crawlers. It's like they have, uh, their suspension is a four-wheel steering. So that one now I've created as a super expert. Can't work my own. Yes. I have my officials mm -hmm. uh, from the crack of the course who mm -hmm. designs the stage, me and him. Mm -hmm. We have the timekeepers, we have the official results. Uh, yeah. So uh, you get a team where mm -hmm. all the marshals we have trained mm -hmm. for them to do the, the marshalling of the stages. Safety is one good thing. We look out for spectators also. Yes. Um, for this event, uh, like uh, when you hear there's a crowd, of course, mm -hmm. is the one who is in charge of whatever is running on the event. He takes care of the stages with his marshals and everything. Mm -hmm. Me as an event director right now for tomorrow, mm -hmm. uh, my work is to oversee everything. Mm -hmm. Because now the work goes now back to the crowd, of course. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, definitely, you know, running anything, it comes with some challenges. What are the ones that you could highlight, maybe? Uh, the, the first one is we are running this without a sponsor. It's from our own pocket, so oh. just like um, looking for sponsor, it's, uh, I've tried and it's not at the negative answers I'm getting. Exactly. It's, uh, we don't have a budget, we don't have a budget for that. But yeah. I'm hoping by the end of the day, when uh, the Ministry of Sports uh, uh, through the CS, I mean, um, Ahmed, yes. maybe they will see what 4x4 four four is coming up. And uh, maybe by the end of the day, we might get a sponsor and we'll push this event to our best and to the higher levels of uh, making it also international. Yes. yes. I would like to know because definitely when you started, I definitely hope that the numbers keeps rising most probably well 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 we started the first event with uh, 11 cars mm -hmm. second event it was a massive entry massive entry we had 24 cars wow yeah mm -hmm. and uh, the other thing is uh, spectators are also enjoying this event and they are coming in big numbers mm -hmm. like i know tomorrow mm -hmm. <laughs> they'll start arriving today by the end of the day yeah by the end of the day i know it will be packed mm -hmm. and there are also people who do camping, mm -hmm. yeah, they don't want to go back home. Oh, here? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. They do camping, so mm -hmm. we hope for the best tomorrow. How, how many are you hoping tomorrow? Yeah. Yes. Um, tomorrow? Yes. Uh, we are hoping by 20, 24 cars and maybe... Or more. Or more. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. like what you're seeing behind me, this is a new car. Oh. Yeah, it's his okay. first entry. Mm -hmm. so from the 24 I had, maybe now they are 25. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And you mentioned something about uh, young drivers. Yeah, yeah. Uh, who is the youngest? Like, how old the is the youngest? The youngest one uh, is about eight years old. Eight years. Yeah, going, uh, eight, uh, eight, 11 there, yeah. He's, and he's the one who won the championship last wow. year. Okay. Yeah, for the beginner. Uh -huh. We had uh, Ben Oyeki, the intermediate. Mm -hmm. And we have. Uh, Ashish, Shah, yeah. yes. one of the experts. 
So definitely they are coming back to defend their titles. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now I'd like you to tell them to come tomorrow. <laughs> well, um, it's welcome to everybody. Welcome and to yeah. everyone. Everybody, uh -huh. Kenya Racing Team, mm. you're welcomed. Mm -hmm. Come and enjoy the 4x4, the first round of the season. Mm -hmm. Welcome. And maybe you can tell us about the next event. When are we expecting to have it? Uh, the next event will be after one month, which will be held by the Murari Sports Club. Yes. Maybe they will take it way back to Champagne Park or somewhere else. Uh -huh. Yeah. Or maybe I can welcome them. They can host it here. Yeah. They are most welcome. Okay. So it's uh, it's in a one, uh, one and a half months time. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Next, yeah. So I'd really like to thank you for honoring us the whole invite. You're, you're welcome. And we wish you all the best. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.